Hi, I'm Streaky. This is Metropolis Mastering, and uh, welcome to the Streaky Show. So I've been in the market for a new set of near fields for quite a while. So I've been this week checking out loads of different versions. As you can see behind me, I've got some Focals. Uh, in the corner, sort of there, I think, on the screen, is some Unity Rocks. And behind there are my old NS10s. I've had some PSIs in here. Um, but what I'll do is I'll tell you everything that I know about speakers and about these little babies that I've been testing out. So first things first with speakers, placement is very important. Obviously my main place to sit is here, head about here. So I'm in the triangle, if you imagine a, a triangle going across the top and across here, so that I'm perfectly positioned here where my hand is. Um, in that way, I get the tweeters going directly to my ears and I get the bass going kind of just below my ears. So these are on some stands which are ISO acoustic stands, which are angled a little bit. Now, these stands are the best ones I've tried for the near fields. I have got, if I zip round the back, I've got some China cones which are on there, which are brilliant as well for my NS10s. They sound good. It makes a massive difference. First things first, if you're sorting out your speakers, get yourself a really good set of stands to put them on to decouple them from the desk. Get them angled up if you're down a little bit from them when they're quite high up, so they're pointing in your ears and sit in the triangle. Now, um, what else I've got in here at the moment is to go with these speakers is this, uh, Trinov audio system, which basically will take takes a trace of the room and then, uh, <laughs> well, you're going to have to look online because it's too complicated, but it basically sees where there's any pits and troughs when it's right in, when I'm right in the centre and it kind of adjusts that as it hits the speakers. Now, I've always been sceptical of this, but it's incredible how good it sounds on these near fields. Um, obviously, the room's pretty good anyway, but it's just the, the it sorts the phase out and it's just an amazing sound so i think uh there is some uh ik multimedia i think that's their name do a version of it so check that out but basically loving these focals they're really nice and tight in the low end i've also got the sub down here um doing its thing sort of down to about 30 hertz these focals are really nice top end very clean bottom end nice and tight so I can't really see what else you'd want in a set of near fields I did I did have the rocks on top end a bit seary for me I mean they're brilliant speakers still the bottom end's nice and tight because they're they're enclosed where these have got a little bit of a, a gap going across the bottom to pump out a bit of sound but they're they're enclosed and so basically the base is is quite tight love those really but a bit seary on the top end these are just really smooth um, so if you're looking for some near fields I would suggest getting a set of those um, but I would definitely get some room correction stuff to check that out um, because that software well this is like a super duper full-on system but you can get like a plug-in version like I said from IK Media that uh, probably will do a similar thing but it's definitely worth checking out in your room anyway just if you've got any kind of dodgy low-end stuff so there you have it, there's a little bit of knowledge on some speakers, not a lot, but um, basically good leads if you've got passives, good powerful amps, Bryston's always really nice. Uh, these definitely get some something to decouple your speakers, that makes a massive difference to the, to the stereo image and the tightness of the low end when you decouple it from your desk. And some room correction software just to mess about with, with the, the bottom end of your room uh, and basically it sorts the phase out of the speakers. Just check it out. You'll be, it's, you'll be amazed, I think, of the result you get. Um, I hope that's helped. Uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe here, 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 here. Please subscribe now so that I don't have to hassle you with an email. And it'll go. Sh you'll hear when there's another update from me. Thanks a lot for watching. Cheers. Bye.